Hello and welcome back to Vixen Purple's Crochet and More. I am your host, Cheryl. Uh, thank you for joining me today. Today is a overcast day. It's nice outside, not too hot, not too cold, enough to have the windows open and for life noises going on outside as well as inside. You'll hear my basset hound, Rascal. He's whining. He wants to come in. He doesn't want to be outside because he thinks mom's being mad at him, which is not. I want him out for fresh air. <laughs> Can't stay in the house all day too long. So in this video, I wanted to show you guys some ARC Thrift Store um, haul. Um, these are a couple weeks. No, longer. I bought these a lot longer. Um, trying to have time to sit down and do videos has been almost near impossible. Um, before I get started, the, this afghan here, this afghan here on this chair is thrift store finds. I think I found them about a year, year and a half ago, maybe two, give or take. I just don't remember. Old age. See, I'm getting the gray hairs. So it's all right there. <laughs> um, the dragon is a Valentine's Day gift that my hubby bought me years ago. Those are some makes that I had uh, done in previous videos. Then I think I showed them all to you. But anyhow, with this, I wanted to show you guys a thrift store haul that I went to one. Okay, let me back up. This is an arc that I got. We have one, two, three, about four arcs here in the springs and we get they have on saturdays they have uh, what they call four tag sale the four tags could be any color that they have put up on that and most of this stuff that was on their four tag uh sale so i was uh perusing one of the thrift stores and um i came across their crochet books and this is the one I bought I believe this one was half off and I paid uh, the original tag was $2.99 but this is what I picked up there are some really pretty patterns in this book I did get a chance to kind of flip through it here is what the original tag was and I paid $2.99 but that was half off so $1.50 for this the other one that I snatched up in a blinking heartbeat <laughs> was this. It is a normal binder. That is the price that was originally marked and the par the price was $1.49. This was a half off binder. I opened the binder and I've got patterns all in the sheets. Some of these are paid for patterns um, and stuff. And so like there was Captain America. Um, some of them were free patterns, but that, but still even the paper to print them out was, is expensive. I know that because I do quite a bit of that myself. Um, let me show you. This is also another one that I that it has in there. I want to do these. But this is what got me the most was this guy. I don't think this is a, a free pattern. I think this is a paid for pattern just by the the design here. So <clears throat> They've had to pay anywhere from, from $2 and change and up for that pattern, um, for that. But there's some free patterns in here. There's the Squirtle pattern. There's a, no, that's a Charmander, sorry. I don't know my Pokemons, but this is another Pokemon that was a free pattern. There's this one. There's some like Christmas trees. And then, then there's some plastic, uh, oh my goodness, plastic canvas patterns in here as well. 
So, but yeah, I mean, these are some of the patterns that, that even for the price that I would have spent at least 10 bucks just getting the paper printed and the ink as well. But for, for half of that 75 cents, I snatched it up and this is my, oh my gosh, moment type thing. <laughs> so anyhow, that was also at there. And then I picked up this for half off as well. It's some chunky yarn. Let me open it up a little bit so you can see it because I don't know. I don't recall seeing this. So it could be a, uh, oops, I'm sorry. It's not chunky. There we go. It has these little loops on there. Well, it could be a little bit chunky, but yeah. I thought this was a pretty good deal. They had two of them in a package, as you can see. They originally had it for uh, $5.99 for the both of these, and these were at half off. And yeah, I felt like I paid just a slightly too much, but it'll still make a nice little project for that. That's one thing. I also picked up <clears throat> this. Let me get it out of the bag. This little needle. I think this was a regular price, but for $2.99, I wasn't going to complain for it. It's for your threads to go on. Now, I have a bunch of threads, and when I can get to it, I plan on making some project bags because I have a crap ton of fabric. So that's one. Then I picked up this. This was for $2.99. I believe this was a regular. This is that Lion Brand's Jiffy yarn, the thick one. And then there's just no, no um, label on that. Then I picked up thinking I was getting a really nice book. <laughs> yeah, I didn't pay attention to it, but it's also, it's called the Prayer. There we go. And it's knitting. I paid, well, this was marked $3.99. I paid $2 for this. And then it's got some really nice patterns in here. This is really pretty too. So <clears throat> we'll see. I'll have to look at it and do some more things with that. But I picked that up thinking I was getting a crocheted book and I'm like, well, oops, I picked got wrong <laughs> so let's there's that <clears throat> and then this was uh these were full skeins of red heart super saver they had it marked for 2.99 i believe i think this was a regular price but these were full skeins and i wasn't uh going to complain about it it's a dollar fifty a skein i thought that was a fairly decent Price considering how much that was going on then they had this one um, for $2.99 and this was half off yes this is a bunch of scraps but we'll figure out what I'm gonna make with it but I got this at half off and then it had a little bit thicker yarn in it now with something like this i probably could use this as a trim on something if that's not enough same way with these guys i thought these guys would be ideal for if i can get them out of the bag oh, there goes oscar spot barking and having fun um there's these guys it's a like almost like a boucle but it's not but it's got little little tufts on it there you go and i figured you know what this might be a good for like a lovey if there's enough here for it or a small lovey um they had tried to cake it up but i guess there wasn't enough i don't know <laughs> so yeah and you know gotta with the uh, thrift stores you just kind of got to pick and choose the stuff that you guys go through because some of it they want way too much money for it 
when you can practically go buy it brand new and 95% of the time this stuff is discontinued and then they want retail brand new market prices on that um the other thing oh, timber there goes some more bit more stuff this i got uh, was on half off and the only reason why i bought it was because there's a lot of yarn in here this is was also half off this was marked at 4.99 so 4.99 is right there whoops okay it's on a loom and there's practically two balls of yarn in here so my whole intentions on this is to that's pretty soft practically because I don't know what they were planning on doing it oh here we go it is actually charisma heather from loops and threads is the yarn here's the ball band and this is in a purple what do they call this purple yep purple so <clears throat> let me get it out so you guys can see it okay i take that back maybe there's three balls on here <clears throat> so i don't know if they were going to make a hat with this or not i don't know um but yeah i figured i'll just go ahead and take it off and uh Well, the loom's broken, so I'll have to throw it away because the peg came off. But yeah, I'm going to just basically take it off and re-ball up the yarn. And this should be more than enough for a, another nice little project. And the uh, price that I paid for it was for $2.50. And I got three balls of yarn. Chunky yarn at that. So that's, I thought was a fairly good buy. Set that right there. I've got a bag underneath me to show you guys. And then I picked up at that, that one too is, <clears throat> is this guy. This is a um, homespun yarn. And I think this is, it's a Lion Brand cotton yarn. I paid $2, um, it was marked $2.99, but this was a half off. I paid $1.50 for that. So, yeah, that was a good deal. And then I also picked this up. I thought, yeah, for three bucks, that this yarn was more than worth it. But that's what I paid, was $3 for that one. So that was one um, thrift store. Uh, place that I went and I think this location was at the um, what we call the Austin Bluffs location because it's off of a street called Austin Bluffs here in the Springs and sometimes they get uh, good yarn sometimes they don't it's just like I said with all yarns you're just going to have to pick and choose with this stuff so <clears throat> With another uh, thrift store that I went to, I think the same day, I picked up some more pattern books. I picked this one up, and it's called Maggie, what was it, Crochet, Crocheting in Plain English, Easy to Follow Lessons in, in, in Patterns, Sensible Solutions to Nagging Problems, and on, the only book any crochet will will ever need I figured hey what the heck I did pay $3.99 for this I do believe this was full price at the time I bought this so I got that I also picked up this this was a half off tag was the Vanna's Choice by um, A to Z Afghans by Oxmore House I haven't gone through it just yet, but they have a whole bunch of patterns in there. So that was one of them. The other ones that I picked up is these guys. These are more knitting patterns, but 
there's also crochets in there. You just kind of have to look for it. This has um, extra um, sleeve protectors. And I go through a lot of these to um, put patterns in. So with the, the price that I paid for this, this was about half off and it was $3.99. And I got this book. Um, so I paid $1.50. For the notebook plus all the patterns and the extra sleeves can't get that anywhere else this is another thing that I bought um, this one was a little bit more holy cow okay so there's a whole bunch of uh, for project piece um, all kinds of stuff so yeah, they, they have a whole bunch of stuff in here. Free patterns as well as from um, probably uh, paid for patterns as well. But yeah, I figured why not just add it to the pattern collection? <laughs> so who knows? But anyhow, I think I paid about, I think they had it marked for $6.99 and I think I paid $3 for it. So not too bad <clears throat> on that one. So, um, then I picked up this guy. This was half off for $1.49. And this is a bunch of Red Heart Super Saver. I plan on making this and this into a lovey. Hey, sweet pea. You want to come up and say hi? Hmm? Okay, come here. Hello, everybody. This is hey, sweet pea. Hey, come here. Nope, nope. Come here. Say hi. Say hi, sweepy. Say hi. You gonna say hi? Yeah. Do you see yourself in the in the in the camera? Huh? Yep. This is my boy. This is Sweepy. Sometimes you hear him. He likes to be a pain in the butt. <laughs> but he's my boy. He's about um, five or going on five years old, I believe. Yeah, he's getting to be an old man. So anyhow. Um, while I was there at an, another thrift store, and I believe this was the Ark on Uinta, and like I said, they had some uh, had a bunch of these things on sale. So I picked up this. I think this is a Lion Brands Pound of Love. This was uh, marked three dollars. I paid a dollar fifty for it, so I got that. I also picked up two of these Vanna's Choice Premier's Vanna's Choice um, oh sorry Deborah, Deborah Norville's every day these were marked $1.99 I've paid half price for them they got so I got two of those I also oh no this was not you went to this was the arc on Academy that I, I found these at so I do apologize, guys. Wrong store. <laughs> um, they had these on sale as well. This is 100% cotton. This is a big ball. And I picked up one in green, one in yellow. I paid, I believe paid, um, they were marked 99 cents, but I paid half of that, I believe. Same way with this. This was marked 99 cents. I believe I paid half. And I think this is a, an older um, Red Heart yarn. Or if not, it's a Air Dazzle by Caron. They had a half a ball of that Red Heart, um, that Lion Brand Red. This was marked 2 dollars I believe I paid half of that for this. There's still quite a bit of uh, yarn in that. Then I also picked up this guy, and I'm like going, oh, well, this is pretty cool. This would make some good trim, if not something else, but they're pretty much full things. And I believe this is a Yarn Bee Yarn. It's been discontinued a long time ago, but it's like an eyelash, but it still makes a good project. I could use it for trimming. Um loveys or whatever make a hat out of it and then I picked up one in blue this was on sale for 
half off. Oops. That's what I paid. Um, so half of that. So I paid two dollars. Eh, basically a dollar a ball, so I can't complain <clears throat> on that one. And then I had found this guy. This is an older uh, Red Heart. That is so pretty. It's I know this is a discontinued. And I paid half of that, which is a dollar ninety nine. So it's a dollar. So basically fifty cents a ball. Um, I also picked up. This was also marked half off. It was for ninety nine cents. And I got a call a uh, cotton and a uh, fun fur from Lion Brand. Here is another co um, cotton that I picked up for half off, I believe, for $0.99. Cents. There's that one. And then they had this um, Just Yarn, the dollar store Just Yarn. Well, they had it originally for $0.99, cents, and I paid a uh, $0.50 cents for it. So there's that one. I also picked up this Caron... Simply Soft in the color brown. It was marked $1.49. And you can see that it's um, it was also half off on that. And then I also picked up, because I didn't know what I was going to do with it, but I picked it up anyhow. Uh, I picked up this Comfy Cotton from the thrift store. And it was marked $1.49. I picked that up, and I think I paid half off. I'm not sure. I don't remember. Don't quote me. But still, even at $1.49 at regular price through the thrift store, that's a good deal. So I got that, and then I picked up this stuff. <clears throat> I think this is an LYS type yarn. It's 80% wool, 20% acrylic. It was marked half off. This bag was $1.49 for the two of those. So basically $0.75 cents for those. And when I saw this, I thought, wow, you're kidding me, right? For this price? Okay. <laughs> this is... It's scratchy. I'm not sure exactly what it is. I can't read it so I don't know for sure if it's a linen or if it's something else but there was three to this bag it's a hank form it was marked $2.99 I think I got this at half off I'm not sure but for that price for three hanks of yarn that's not a bad deal whatsoever um, last but not least, there was this ball, and this is the velvet yarn. It's the only one that's in there, so that's what it is. This was half off, and this was $1.99. Like I said, half off. For a dollar, yeah, I can make something out of that. I don't know how much is, is used up out of this, but still, that is not bad for that. So, with that being said, I'm already at 24 minutes. I'm going to end this video here with this um, two-store yarn haul. Um, I do have some more pattern books to show you, but I will show it in another video because I have two more videos to make and yeah, so you'll be seeing me in the same shirt <laughs> and the same hairdo with all the life noise as well as outside and inside. So with that being said, I hope you folks have a wonderful day. It's welcome back. Thank you for my new subscribers and my old subscribers. It means a lot that you're paying attention and watching my videos. It means a lot to me. I am trying to put out more videos as much as I can. I can't promise everything. Um, oh, I lied. I have three more videos to make because I have a finished makes video. It's going to be a short one.
but it's going to be there. Anyhow, <laughs> with that being said, you guys take care. I will see you guys in the next video. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.